Hello and welcome to Annan versus Alawa at Gallo Bank. Don't adjust your sets, that is just the outrageously loud music here at Annan. Alawa make two changes from the side who won 1 0 against Stenhouse Muir, but it was one substitute who made a big impact with Stefan Skugel coming in in place for Luke Donnelly. Well, Morgan Neal comes in at centre back again as Kane Thompson drops to the bench. A win could easily put Alawa into the top spot in the league. But the same could be said for Annan, having an excellent start to the season. However, they they got their first league defeat of the season last week against Queen of the South, and they're missing key players in the shape of Rico Katongo, Josh Todd, and uh, the standout in the from his last year, Aidan Smith. Annan get us underway. Big launch forward, looking for goals. He's always such a target. Wins it as well. Dave Mackay. Alawa enjoying possession so far. Looking very calm, composed on the ball and knocking it about. Steve Hetherington. Wide to centre half, or centre midfield partner. And all the way back to centre half, Morgan Neal. Just knocking it about nice and calmly, building slowly. Morgan Neal plays the pass forward to Dave Mackay. Wide. With Steve Buchanan up against player manager Willie Gibson. Is he going to take him on? Drives to the byline, crosses in, sends it to the back post and left back Callum Waters heads towards goal. Great save by Smith. Colley. Unfortunately, doesn't he find the pass back the way, but it's going to stay in. Alawa send it back up the line to Waters and inside to Skugel. Colley. Waters, left footed delivery. Oh, completely fluffed, and it's dropped for Stefan Skugel. He gets his first goal of the season. Drills it straight down the middle into the Annan goal. I'll tell you what, for a player manager, that is a, a hard one to take because Willie Gibson has absolutely fluffed the clearance. We say it so often about Stefan Skugel that if he could add more goals to his game, well, he wouldn't be at Alawa. What a player he would be. But you don't get many easier than this. Brilliant cross into the middle. But very, very easy. Hannon looking for a quick reprieve. Got wind advantage in this first half, you can see by that flag in the corner, and it's going to be floated into the middle. Tommy goes. Oh, very lightweight goes down. You can see there is a back contact on the foot, but you're going to give penalties for that. Well, might have 20 penalties a game. Gibson's corner. Halloween completely leave Goss unmarked. It's over. Morrison off the line by Robertson, off the post. From Harrison Wood, cross in from Gibson, it's still not clear, it's going to be down for Wood again, he beats the goalkeeper and another clearance away by Roberts. Wood again this time sends it and it's going to be over, is it going to be collected by Gibson? Still not away, Zaid on the edge of the box, claims it. Sends it onto the edge of the box, Fleming has a strike that's blocked. Yet another set piece for Annan. Into the middle. Goss rises his highest. Just heads a yard wide to go. Gibson's throw to Zaid. Goss holds it up. Goes for goal, but what a team ever that is. Very poor shot. Throw up the line. Tommy Goss. Scored well by Dixon. Woods has Ryan Muir charging up the right hand side. Can he find the delivery? Right foot. Oh, and in a six yard box and back on tap between Mackay. But Morrison claims it. Oh, that is a lovely ball into the six yard box. Stephen Buchanan will claim it. He'll cut it back for Kevin Colley. Ah, good block off the back of Muir. The captain, the centre half. Was throw. Kevin Corley does square it to Mackay. He's going to take it on himself and gets it wide to Buchanan, played into the box through Tiger. Oh, good defending by Muir. Could have easily sent that into his own net instead. Oh, 
Have a look to sell for the throw. And it is a long throw aimed in towards Salmon. Flicked away by Annan. Collected by Curtis Roberts. Just calmly plays it back the way to Neil. And he'll get it back. Oh, that is an outrageous ball through. Down by Skugel. Whistle goes as Salmon puts it in the bottom corner. But that is a poor, poor decision from the officials. Stefan Skugel at least a yard on side. And Alloa should be 2-0 up. Kevin Coley. Linking up in the middle. Gets the ball back from Skugel and should play it wide. He finds Callum Waters, who again is marauding high up the field. Plays it into Sam and it's just beyond him. Skugel can't get the connection. Good move by Alloa again though. Throwing into Skugel. Outrageous flick to Kevin Coley. He'll have the shooting opportunity and deserved a better finish after that flick. Stefan Skugel again looking so bright today. Annan with a long throw opportunity. And it is into Tommy Ghost. Laid off for Dixon and doesn't he catch it very nicely, but it is going into the bottom corner. Alaba should be able to get it clear. Muir into Wood's feet. Instead, he's going to take it on a run instead of playing it up the line. I don't know if he's got the ball back from Zaid on purpose, but defenders finish as he had the goal gaping at his mercy. Delivery from Gibson is met by Goss again, headed down and back into the danger area. But Tommy Muir is sitting through on the six yard box. Alloa maybe going to sleep a little bit. Vicious crossfield ball, but what a hit that is. It's going to be collected by Buchanan before it hits the byline. Cross the six yard box, Salmon's in. And Annan get it clear. Big, big go. Throw up the line, Tagger. Salmon is beaten towards it, but Stevie Hethering cuts the ball out and he can do enough to knock it into the path of Buchanan. He's done well to knock it into Skugel as well. Plenty of men in the box and Oh, that's a lovely bit of improvisation from Hetherington. He'll get a second attempt, but flag goes up over there. Wonderful way to open the play from Hetherington, though. Good feet from him. Waters out swinging delivery. His headed away. Zaid, can he carry it? Chance for an Annan counter. Takes the ball on the run well, and Callum Waters is chasing. Annan have the, the, the main advantage now. Three Annan players veering towards the back post. If they can find them. Oh my goodness. Dixon has completely messed up that. And Gibson balloons it over PJ Morrison's goal. Call it. Let's check back and plays it to Morgan Neal. Callum Waters back to PJ Morrison. Alawa. Content to pass the ball about at the back and. Invite Annan up onto them. Oh, that's poor though from Morgan Neal, giving it away under no pressure. Gibson, is he going to charge forward? Lays it perfectly into Dixon. Struck high at the front post. Good solid hand to it from PJ Morrison. Corner Annan. But my goodness, Alawa. They're going to continue to ride their luck. Annan. Send the ball into the middle and it's right across the face of the six yard box. Oh, Harrison Wood, Tommy Muir and Tommy Goss all in there. Waters does aim towards Salmon, he'll get the ball straight back though and has the opportunity to dink it into Hetherington and that's nicely into Salmon's path and he tries to place it. Good solid hand from Jamie Smith. Salmon, he should have had a goal earlier. Just a Launch forward into Salmon's chest. Well, well taken down, and Donnelly can play it forward. Taggart Marauden sends across into the middle. Flicked on by Salmon. And easily into the path of Smith. Big, big opportunity here. Stevie Hellington's customary yellow card in this game. Hopefully, that's all we can talk about. But set piece looks likely as for Annan, and it will be Gibson to step up. I think that just sums up Anna's day in front of goal. 